Today I'm going to show you my lipstick collection. It's not a lot, but it's there, and I just want to show you them. So, so I have Vaseline here with me, so that I can erase the lipstick so that they won't stain and change the color, the natural color. So here we're going. Uh, so we're going to start with my lip mate then the last one is lip gloss so here we have fixing tint from Edward house this is in the shade of ginger milk tea there's like five shades if i'm not mistaken and all of them are warm tone warm tone and all of them are warm tone and they recently just released a cool tone version which only has three or two shades I'm not quite sure about that. Are you here? Eh, sabar jawab. Tak nampak. Okay. Nude shade. Hmm. I would say this is a MLBB shade. But I'm not quite sure for you. But for me, this is MLBB but a bit nude. Oh, by the way, don't mind this. This is like an acne patch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, yeah. So, yet again, um, what was I saying? So yeah, this is the shade on my lips. Nampak macam natural, right? And if you guys like don't want lipstick that is not striking, or macam, eh, nampak lah yang kau pakai makeup or lipstick and you don't want that, right? We can use this lip tint. Oh yeah, this is, this is a tint, not a... This is a tint, but the outcome is made so lip tint lip me mm -mm. well i guess if you put a lot i think i'm like good version okay let me do a reapplication so this is after i reapply like two coats sama tak mm. lagi sama lah so this lip tint it it is mm, mask proof so if i wear a mask usually i would go for this lip tint because it won't have that much smudge or sometimes it won't have any smudge at all well the trick is that you need to coat you need to put a thin coat and then let it dry so that, so that it won't smudge a lot and then if you want another coat then let then you just put on another thin coat and then let it dry so this is facing tint from Etude House okay now we have um, Maybelline color sensational creamy mate I got this as a free gift and the code is in touch of spice 660 <coughs> I got this as a free gift from Guardian yeah so let me swatch it for you it's not that bad like I I thought I wouldn't like it but at least I like it lah it's like a bit pink movie move like that it is not um transfer proof it comes out it, it comes off really easily on my hand on my lips Ooh. oh i don't usually use this actually since it is a free gift so i really don't care about it and wouldn't even buy this with my own money but sometimes I do wear it when I want to now, like for fun or, or like it matches my it matches my eye makeup that day or something. But it's not that bad. You can try it if you want to. Okay, next one. Oh, also the when also the lipstick the lip mint tastes really weird. Um, um, the next lip mint is also from Maybelline, which is the line sensational liquid made in the coat of early nude so this one i bought in guardian too and it was i was like it was a random decision i was just looking uh looking around the lipstick and i just thought oh maybe this would be a pretty color so i just picked it up and unfortunately i do like this technique juma it is just 
quite drying now in my opinion here it is on my hand it's like a bit brownish like that but when you put it on your lips if you put like a like a like a thick coat in my opinion it wouldn't make your face or lips look that so what i usually do is just i chill up skate and then i dab it off a bit and just sikit je lah i put it on my lips sikit je and just i tap it with my finger selalunya if i just want it want to wear this lipstick on its own lah um right look it doesn't make it still looks nice on your lips but nowadays lah, i would usually um wear this with the etude house lip tint first i use the lip tint as the base and then i use this and i put it like at the outer corners here right and then i also tap it you can call it as a lip liner but it's not a lip liner <laughs> it looks good like in my opinion okay now i'm gonna show you if you put it like banyak like a thick coat on it but when you put it on your lips like full full right eh, 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 eh. It looks really greyish, and right, if you look that, unless this is what you want to go for, yeah, it's like a bit brownish, and hmm, but on your lips it look it looks greyish, but it's not bad, you know. Like it still look like I would still wear this, but not all the time, you know. Okay, now we have a uh, faux color. Uh, some for color lip mint from the same line which is i think the clay i i to be honest i don't know but here it says clay so maybe from the clay line and remember that the finish is really velvet if it's really velvet which doesn't dry your lips that much which is great but the thing is that it comes off easily you got i'm gonna start with the lightest shade first which is zero 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 so zero 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 is um more to the orangey side look orangey i usually like i usually ever do when i first got them i would do a full lip like this lah full lip mm -mm. i would usually do a full lip zero 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 yeah but nowadays okay i like to do a gradient lip so when i Oh, what that do? So when I um, so when I da put um all, oh, so when I da apply it like this, right? I'll take a tissue or just use my fingers really and scrape off the lipstick on the near the near the corners of my mouth. Then I put a gradient. I put a tadi. The thing is that I'm using the camera as my mirror right now, so I don't know what's going on, I could. But yeah, zero is zero, zero. Okay, the next one is this one zero four. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, but my lips are so much of thing are burning right now. <laughs> but it's okay. We're almost done, to be honest. Okay, so this is one zero four. Oh wait, look at <laughs> Swatch on the hand first. Yeah, so this is like a more to a brownish brownish nude shade it's so pretty i love it lah and i think most of you guys will love this too 104 this sort of like a mlbb mlbb but in a nude more to a muted nude toned down brownish shade i love I love it babes i love it okay i will show you how it looks like with the gradient so this is how it looks if you do like a gradient sort of oh lava okay now for the last um last let me from the same line which is 301 i think yeah it's it's 301 so this is the darker shade that i have from this collection 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 <gasps> dang this is why i need a mirror to be my letter and oh i like lupa la lupa swash hand first mark so this is how 301 looks like 
it's small to the red red shade but it's not that like bright chilly red it's like red shampoo shampoo a bit of brown 301 so out of all the three lipstick you can this is the most this is the hardest one to control because like if you look closely right and also if you look closely or in real life you can like notice that there's like a bit of patchiness like look ni nampak lebih um like lighter than this one nampak so yeah if you want to use this you really like gotta be more diligent macam tu lah 301 gradient lip sort of cool now for the last two lip mates that I have that I have with me right now which are eh no which is the second last one is from wet and wild in the cat liquid cat suit line so this is scarf topic so an interesting story is that <coughs> i was looking for a black lipstick an affordable one lah, and i couldn't find one so i thought hey let's try this one since this is the most affordable darkest lipstick shade that i could find it's not even black it's like a purplish purplish brown much like too but if you apply it um oh i forgot so <laughs> much and if you apply it like you apply it um more than one coat it will look sort of like a black lipstick also this lip made bush it stains it it has a really strong stain uh, oil balm or oil cleanser right it's really hard to take it off so then yeah mm, golf topic it's really a pretty shade like oh the lawas yeah suka gila okay for the last lip me that i have wait me it's room for color okay wait a minute yo look i told you it's really hard to come off you know the, the last shade lipstick shade is black so it doesn't matter Nampak macam my lip is bleeding right now But it's not, don't worry So this is from For Color Stage in So this is oh, A black lipstick So look at the lip, lip craving Craving The lip carving on it Chome Okay So this is finally a black one Ta-da This lipstick has a Like a mint Yeah, but yet yeah, a glossy finish to it it's like I don't powdery terus lah it still has like a little shine so this is toxic ooh 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 this is a good black lipstick tapi can well it is not transfer proof you know eh we're not even using glossy right now but it comes off really easily so yeah but i think it's reasonable lah as the price is not that um it's not that the price is affordable so i'm not mad mm. we have come to the last section of this video which is my lip gloss which i only have three total not that a lot but just three well i used to be a lip gloss addict now i'm the not that wild so look it's quite sure but it has cool specs in it so now on my lips usually i wear this as a top coat or or which which is very rare lah, but i usually use this at night because <laughs> i don't know when i want when i want to use this because in the morning i usually wear um, either lip gloss or lip mates so I just I always use this during the night it's transparent to me if you look closely there's close specs so this is magic in the in the coat off um to be honest I also don't know <laughs> okay cool now for the next lip gloss 
this I have two from the Focalo Focalo Super Gloss line and also think only the packaging is originally like this but I recently dropped this um this evening lah and think all the correct but well faham lah because it's not that this thing is plastic and it's not that expensive tau so whatever doesn't even matter as I can the lip gloss is not spilled ke contaminated ke apa kan for zero one so yeah I think this is a good ML MLBB shade uh, and I think you guys would really love this as you can use this for anywhere lah uh -uh, anywhere anytime to work, office ke, apa ke, you know in zoom class oh but so this is 401 and we don't call any oh so yeah, I'm an ML baby mm -hmm. okay now for the last and lip gloss oh yeah, I forgot to tell you that this lip gloss actually stains the pee because of because that I just use it sekejap je just just <coughs> sekejap for a short of amount of time it doesn't stain that much but if you let you let it on for about I would I think about 10 to 15 minutes it will have a stain a bit of stain on your lips so that when you makan or when you wipe it off ke apa right um your lips won't look that Oh wow, I forgot to hand swatch again. Okay, let me just swatch it on my hands. This is 405. This one. It's more darker than the previous lip gloss. Also, this is in the brown brown category, I think. Then it's red but it has a hint of brown. 405. You know what you call it? So, yeah, it's really pretty. They are not much, but in my opinion, they are enough for me. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. See you soon. Good night. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum.